Remember, I always tell you guys that uh, I'm always right and you should give me my flowers. What? It's, it's a shy motor song of the year again. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, did you see Chevy Sheets numbers? Hey! Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, they're twerking hard, those numbers, bro. <laughs> Fuck! There's that shit that they're twerking. Oh, it's weaker rand, high interest rates. Look at that. They even fixed the bakery because that's where the dough's at. Hi, you know? Bo. <laughs> you guys must actually like said, let people send photos. All the white people, let them send photos to say. Bleh. The subscribers, yes, all the white people. And we'll see how many they are. No, we must have a brunch for white chillers only. <laughs> Tongan beers, it's about 22,000 beers per person per year. Yo! No waste, bro, no waste! Like, like this beer? No waste! Yay, yay, yay! No waste, bro! Linda! Barmini! Chillers worldwide, save the date. Yes. Dun, dun. Next one? week, Monday, we're dropping something really special. Very, very special. Something that um, I've been working on for like two years or not? Mm. Yeah, yeah, two years. Yeah. Mm. Um, I've worked on a lot of things when it comes to the podcast since it started. Yeah. yeah. But I'm really excited about this, man. Mm. Like, this no, I wanted to create something that embodies like the journey that we've been, you know, since the podcast started. Like, yeah. We've been through so much, bro. I was telling Ghost Lady, like, even um, uh, when we did our first uh, year end function, yeah. it was just the five of us. Yeah. <laughs> That's the bride. Yeah. Humble, humble beginnings, man. <laughs> now we're booking out lodges because hey. the team has grown. We've got like more than 40 people working for us. Sessions. You know what yeah, I mean? That's beautiful. So, so I wanted to create something that embodies, like, you know, what it means to be a chiller. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, like. Ah, fuck, man. It was so awesome creating this. So, yeah. We're going to drop it next week, Monday. I'll, I'll, I'll announce it next week, Monday. But this is for the chillers. Next week, Monday, we're going to drop it next week, Monday. We're going to drop it next week, Monday. Ah. It's for the chillers. I was oh. going to ask you what you think it is, but you're too good with these things. It's yeah. probably going to get it right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh. Hey, son, it's too good nah, with these nah, things. No, no, no. I have no idea. For real. <laughs> I'm just as curious as the chillers. Yeah. I'm curious as well. So, so, watch out. Next week, Monday, we'll drop it. But you can uh, follow us on social medias. Uh, oh. This week, just to get a glimpse of what you might think it is. All right. And there's some cool prizes for people who guess it right. Oh. Wow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dope. Yeah. Do you think you know what it is? No, I don't, bro. Come on, take a guess. I'm clueless. Something oh, for the chillers. To guess. Oh. Something for the chillers to say thank you for all the years they've been supporting us. What does it look like? Ah, uh, Bana, what is it, boy? Okay, tune in next week, Monday, to uh... find out. <laughs> Kato, do you know? <laughs> Yeah, that's the Well, you that's worked that's on it, right? Yeah, so, yeah, it's a, yeah. so it's a video. It's a video. Is that where you're going? I can't. Ah, man, what is it? Yeah, if Tato and them worked on it, then it must be a yeah, video. Yeah, if Black Studios worked on it, it must clearly oh, be a video. But it could mean a product that had there to take a photo of. That could also. A calendar! Don't save the dates <laughs> on your calendar, especially. Anyway, hit the button, ladies and gentlemen. We are back. Yes! Back from my year and function. <laughs> and so you missed out again. again. <laughs> Yo, my no. feet, yo. Sorry. Yo, uh, uh, Tibblers here, Ghost Ladies here, Dudus here, Tato's here, yeah. Neo's here, yeah. Fat Checkers here. Yeah. Simpio, we just got a haircut, looks like an AI. Yeah. You look like an AI portrait, man. Come, come, come. Yeah, he looks like come, an come, AI come, 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 come. No, come, bro, come on. He looks like an AI. Ghost AI, come, come, come. You know those AI come, images? Come, yeah. Show <laughs> my man. Show my man. Villa Lapa Umek, Villa Lapa Umek. Show yourself, show yourself. Doesn't he look like AI? Look at him. You look fake. You look fake, right? You look, you look very fake. What's going on, bro? <laughs> so, Saul, um, you joined us on um, Tuesday. I joined you on day one. Day one. on Tuesday, I joined you Tuesday, then I left the following day. And Tuesday, you went to go sleep when we were playing games. Yo. Yes, because and I had, had been fun. up since three o'clock in the morning. Yeah. Yeah, because of, of the show in the morning. And the so edibles was, knocked you out. Yep. Uh, not really. Uh, edibles are forever, bro. Mm. Come on now. I mean, <laughs> edibles are forever, man. It wasn't the edibles. I was just genuinely tired. Yeah, and yeah. And I was really tired. Mm. Then I went to sleep. So, uh, like at 10. and then we woke up Wednesday. We shot the show. Yes. Which will be up. When is it dropping, Dudu? 
I think last week of December, ne? Yeah. The 28th. Uh, be the last 20th, show. Yeah, 28th yeah, makes December. Sense. Makes yeah. sense. Yeah, where we had popcorn and cheese spreading humors. Yeah. Make sure you check out that show. On it's side. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. Um, and then you left after we shot. Yes. That, like in the afternoon. Yes, okay. after we shot. Yeah, then I left. Yes, I, I missed the last poisoning. evening. What happened? Yes. What happened? What happened? What happened? What happened? What happened? What happened? Should you should you tell him? Must I tell him? Because then, just yeah? the people who are, who are feeling very guilty just went no, <laughs> no. What happened? What happened? What happened? So we ended up uh, just chilling, drinking. You know the usual. Yeah, 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 yeah. Then we went to the fire, played some more games. Now while we're playing these games, we can see hey, people are leaving one by one. Yeah. Hey, I feel it. So now. At the end of the night, I think it was just like me, Robert Boy. Who else was there with us? Dudu was there, Tibla, Zile. Like maybe 10 of us are left now. Yeah. We're like, all right, guys. Let's call it a night. So I'm like, ah, fuck it, man. Let's wake up everyone that's sleeping. It's our last night. Yeah. Let's just go there to each, each room and just wake up people for the yeah. fuck of it, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we go to we Jason. We Money Lodge, by the way. Eh? At For Money. We have For Money Lodge, yeah. yeah. So we go to Jason. Yeah. So Jason's sleeping with Zile, Tabang, and Jason in one room. But they all have different beds. Yeah, different. Okay, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Like yeah. a dorm. So we get there, we wake them up. We're like, ah, wake up, wake up. And then we found Neo. Then we went to Neo. <laughs> we found Neo. Neo was busy on the computer. Who turns on us? Mara, there's a whole bottle <laughs> you of lotion. Of lotion. Of lotion. <laughs> There was a there was a tub of lotion. There was a tub of what lotion. happened? What next happened? To right next to him. Hey, <laughs> at one in the morning, Shh. what he was doing? Asas. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> hey, now oh, I fed it. Then we go to Ghost Lady. Ghost Lady, and we knock. She opens. Ah, she gets a fried boom. Wake up. Whatever. Whatever. Sharp. Cool Mind you, so wait, they're trying to search who, who are people sleeping with, you know. Uh, uh, so we're when, not. when, 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 not. when we're just waking up people, yeah, yeah, because you can't be sleeping, yeah. it's the last day of the year and function. Yeah, oh. We're just waking up people, we just, you know, we're innocently just no, but there's a search, have some fun it's on the last night. Why are you disturbing your story? Oh, no, 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 I'm you just, you're I'm, found. I'm, you I'm pre- I no, I was not found. You yeah, see, they're moving away, she's disturbing. She was in a similar situation as Neo when we got there. Ah, <laughs> she was in a similar situation yeah. as Neo. Oh, what no. situation? <laughs> what situation? We interrupted her, her me time. <laughs> <laughs> okay, wait, wait, wait. What happened when you got to? Okay, so you got to go ladies' room. What happened? No, she was just like, oh, she was like scared, like oh, like you know, like um, we bombed it. <laughs> you didn't you know? lock. No, it locked. So what they did is that. Um, it was Dudu who knocked and said something about a swimming costume. Remember, me and Dudu here, she's been coming to my like to my room like the whole day. Oh, and you're getting she, ambushed. Some, yes. yes, ambushed. So and she's like, yes. no, I'm not I said, I don't know what she said about the costume. Watch what I, okay, yeah. I walk out. And then when she opens, there's like 10 people. People yeah. just, and they're all like, oh, yes. Yeah, right? that's yeah, how yeah, it okay. was. Yeah. So they were like, all right, let's go to Bada. I but I didn't open. <laughs> you couldn't find open. him actually. No, we found him. He said he didn't open. He heard us. Oh, but he didn't okay. open. Sharp fed. And then we're like, okay, let's go to Fed Checkers room. Hmm. So we get there. When we get there, How? we knock, we knock. Ah, no one's opening. We're like, ah, they're probably sleeping. Let's leave. And then as we're about to leave, she opens. As she opens, she was like, Were you like half naked? No, she was wearing. Pajamas. Pajamas. Yeah, she was in she her was PJs. Fully okay, dressed. okay. So we walk in there. She's yeah. in her PJs. We're like, ah, oh, wake up, wake up, whatever. Yeah, and yeah. That's over. And then we leave. So this is me, TT, Robert Poe. We are leaving. Dude is like, hey, wait, guys. I see a corona here. And I see a man's sandals here. Hey, Detective Dudu. Yo, Detective <laughs> Something Dudu. Something is going on. So yeah. now we rush back. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. To Fat Jacker's room. Yeah. Then we check in. Then we open the wardrobe. Guess who we find? My wardrobe. <laughs> we found Todd. All along is in the fucking closet. Yes! yes. Camping. Hey. Hiding in the closet. Now he's out. <laughs> so now you're out the closet. You guys, it's not what you're thinking. Let me tell you. Okay, come out the closet. Be straight with us. Come out the closet. What happened? Let me tell you guys, though. Me and Fact Checker are friends. So, so why are you hiding? Why are you hiding? Born. Me and Fact Checker are friends. So Fact Checker is like, I'm going to go to the church. I'm going to go to the church. Yes. So, I'm going to go to the church. I'm going to go to the church. I'm going to go to the church. 
Utimbole, which I should have told me, and Bolega, and then we have our charge to Uzo Alzo Landa, Bessemas of our land. Bessemina Hamba, eh, 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 no, no young to step. Bashako, no young to step. I call him Bashako. So we got the church, I have monks that are causing me assuming putting petit or two lunch. You want your figure up again, get a feature and go to church. Monks having a church, okay, go to church, fetch a good nigh and empire. Mbei tatu lo church. Serious talk. serious. Why Let me tell you. You innocently there to let me drop off a charger to charge. To recharge. Why I was hiding? Because in kabangi lengati, mabengangena la. Ah, you start to make some assumptions and say there was something going on here. But listen, talk serious, serious. And then. Ah, and then man, not he has gone putting his feet, but check over with check over and bapoom. Cause my bang tonala, but the booze are my cushion, my ningy, but a soo, my crew me does neck. I won. Can't mang it in his feet. Mang it in his feet, cause in hind, cause he got to la pia. I won. Nangan o tropin. Then the government bang and to the wood it got to lozam, so I can't go to Nanta Venzagala. Mara, there was nothing happening. I just. I was just there to How talk long did Fake Checker take to open? Quite a while. Oh, oh, that's why we almost left. So she was getting dressed. Yeah, that's why we almost left. Oh, yeah, yeah. Why did you take a while to open? Because you weren't sleeping. He had woken you up. You guys were up. He was there to leave a charger or whatever. Yeah. Because I knew it was you guys. Literally. And, and why I is knew. it locked? Why is it locked? If you if you just arrived, door open. going out soon, why would you lock him in? Why did you lock him in no, if he was gonna go out door now? Door now, open. The other door was open. The only door that was closed was the one that they got in. But you guys are grown ups. Why are you like being crazy about your stuff? You are grown up. No, I'm not too But you so good at no fake check. So we have to be careful. <laughs> and it's so happy that you are getting the charger from fake checkers' room. Yeah, because now I'm sleeping. Uh, no, was was with the, the tub full of okay. lotion and porn. As far as, you as, as, sleep, as, far as I knew. No, no, no. no. Okay, you had a tub full of lotion in front of a laptop. <laughs> Let's firstly ask. Did I close what? The browser was. Nah, nah, nothing like that. Browser. <laughs> okay, let's first on the browser. No, I was browser on the browser. I, I was staying with four people. And you were playing the, with four people? No, I was staying with four people inside the 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 the, the villa. The, the villa, villa, right? Uh. Why you guys found the door unlocked? Anything? If I was doing something, you know. But uh, you were the only one awake. They were sleeping. No, no, they were not. He was, he was awake. He was with you guys, and that's his tab. That's his. That's his. That's his <laughs> he doesn't want to say he's he's busy there. He's just laughing. I'm Who's like, Vaseline you Vaseline? left your thing here on the table. Who's you, Vaseline? You, this guy, because I was sharing oh, the room you, with you, him. He was one of yeah. the guys yeah. sharing. So, so the now you know what happened. My guy entered first. He didn't even see that, thing, right? And he's like, nah, guys. Now it's busy, it's fine. And then all of them came in. No one noticed anything until stop sign. Uh, the driver of robot said, oh. wait, what is this thing here? Like, it looks bad, I won't lie. What is it? I was like, yeah, shit. Very bad. Next yeah, this thing right bad. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> so I, I was not using that thing. I don't use that, though. I don't use Vaseline. <laughs> what do you use? What do you use? Hold on, hold on. What do you use? What do you use? Hold on, what do you use? What do you use? No, no, no. To, 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 put, to put on my body. You know what? Ah, <laughs> ah, that's not what you meant. You were like, nah, you don't nah. use Vaseline. Nah, I don't use so what Vaseline. What do you use? I don't use lotion. <laughs> <laughs> what do you use, man? Pads. <laughs> 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 Come on now, make pale fish oil. Now it's good to one. So fair. Eh? Damn, bro. Then we leave then. Eh? Yeah. Uh then like we ran out of rooms to 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 knock at. Yeah, yeah. So everyone is up now. Yeah. So we're like ah, fuck it. Let's call it a night. <laughs> and then it just so happens we buy Dudu's room now. But so, Dudu has been with you all along. Yeah. How can you move? <laughs> open people's ears. Yes, places. she's, yeah, she's yeah. been with us the whole time. So it just so happens we buy Dudu's room. So now Tato has joined us now. Tato's like, aye, let's open Dudu's room. We're like, ah, man, there's nothing there. She was with us the whole time. Yeah, she's probably yeah, going to yeah. go sleep. Nothing to see there. Yeah. Aye. We're like, aye, fuck it, let's go in. It's the last room anyway. So we go into Dudu's room. How? At first, we saw nothing. Hey. Okay. Hello, then, Nan. The Tutu is with Tato, you guys. I think Tato knew something. Also, oh, like... they, they detected one another's <laughs> shit. Because Tutu detected him in her room. Hey, he detected him in Tutu's room. 
<laughs> so guess what? who he finds in the bathroom? He goes to the bathroom. Tuso, ne? Because I haven't heard of Tuso and the his whereabouts. Tuso. Tuso. Tuso is sleeping, ne? Yeah. Tuso was sleeping. No, no, Tuso wanted Seema the whole the whole time. So he was with Seema. Oh, okay, cool. Yeah, oh, I remember with the nails, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So, 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 who's in Dudu's take, take a wild guess. Bathroom. No. Take a wild guess. Mm-mm. Who was there? DJ. Ah. Ah. Pops manager. Oh, Pops manager. No, no, no. Because no. I'm thinking of someone you guys haven't mentioned. You're with Robert. Who's, uh, uh, who, what is Robert? Is he the cheese or the popcorn? He's the cheese. He's, He's the, the cheese. cheese. Yeah, Pops. and someone from the cheese team. From the cheese gang. Titi. No. Titi's with us, dog. He's knocking yeah. the doors with us. Hey. One last guess. Hey. One last guess. Robert Pops manager. Yes! <laughs> Hey. <laughs> we found him camping in the bathroom there. <laughs> you found him do what? Camping in the bathroom. Oh, camping? Yeah. Why was he camping there? He needed a shower. <laughs> Wait, but he had Guys, his own room. Uh, he room. didn't. It was in the, <laughs> Wait, his room was like, like 15 minutes away. They had to drive out. <laughs> so I was with them. And because we're busy, so we went for um, a game drive. Not a game drive, quad biking with Mac. So he was like dirty, full of dust. He just wanted to go take a shower while we were going I'm around. Mad. Hey? Black guess it. Like. <laughs> no, he, he was literally full of dust. So you way. knew he was in there? Yes, because he just wanted to take a shower. So that's all that happened. I was with them. Who was he sleeping where there's no shower? No, because it was far. They had to drive off. They were in the other lodge. They were oh, in the other lodge. Yes. Yeah. 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 So these ones are making a thing out of it. <laughs> you believe it? No, if she, if he was based at Euphoria, which is across the road, exactly. and quite a walk, it makes sense. It makes yeah. sense, Do guys. you know how many rooms you have to go past before you get to Doodoo's? You could have showered in any of those rooms. But he asked the person, he just, you know, he <laughs> asked in the moment. Yeah. And I just gave him the keys, honestly. How come uh, you didn't use I'm my room? Serious. Because my left my room. Yeah, like, he didn't your... know. Why didn't you leave? Where, where, where were your keys, so? I left it in, I didn't lock my room. I just left it in the door. Oh. No, he didn't know that. Honestly. Uh, yeah. <laughs> you believe that? Yeah. Um, don't be shocked when Dudu comes out with the own flavor of more fire. And- yeah. <laughs> you, you see Dudu's Dudu face. Tron. <laughs> it's like Dudu Tron. You should have shot Dudu Tron. Dudu Tron. But I Dudu's face in the car very soon yeah. on a track. Yeah. Ah, <laughs> oh, but it was mad fun, man. Shout yeah. out to Fumani Lodge for hosting us. Uh, they're out in Murimula. Um, they have various facilities and activities there, man. They've got a stunning restaurant. That's what we're there to launch. Yeah, stunning restaurant. Uh, it's been refurbished. The food is exquisite. Oh. There's a spa there, uh, which Saul enjoyed. Yeah, I enjoyed it big time. Beautiful. Uh, there's also quad biking, game driving. You get to see giraffes, kudus, wildebeest. Uh, yeah, and there's so much more there, man. There's horse riding as well. Yeah. And most of all, it's black owned. Bro, shout you out know? to those guys, man. Yeah. Oh, man, that was oh. wild. <laughs> Yeah, Carmen, we should have a uh, yeah end every week. Hey, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. No, we had fun. We had fun oh, all together. Man. Yeah. Anyway, where do you guys want to start, man? What do you want to talk about first, so? Kanye all has has the goods. Mm. Oh, you know, for me, so you know, you know my goods though, my goods. No, don't go with the stories first. What do you want to talk about? As yes. Kanye. As Kanye. As Kanye. Mm. Hey. Is Rihanna pregnant again? They're saying Apparently. that. I hope no not. Way. Apparently. I hope not. No. no, that guy better marry that girl, man. Three babies. Hey. As 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 no, no, I think Rihanna is in that era of ASAP. <laughs> as soon as, <laughs> soon as she gives breath, niggas up in there, rocking in the ASAP. As soon as possible, baby. No, but I got food in there. I got food up for you. Yeah, it's always the time. I want to zip. 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 <laughs> yeah, Maru Rihanna. Yeah, Maru. I ain't got time to do that. Shout out to ASAP Rocky, man. No, I think I think Rihanna is like the one who probably who definitely wants the babies because I think I think before she was so obsessed with her. It was was it her niece? Like there's a daughter like that. There's a baby that she was always shooting with, and you could see like she just wanted to have children. Wow. So. I think she's living in her era and she resembles, I think of her right now as that person who says, I want to have my all, all my children like fast, 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 fast. Mm. You know? yeah, White people do that a lot. Yeah. Like, you know? Fuck, seven, five, yeah. three, done. I wanted that as well. But yo, after my first one, I was like, I, yeah, no way. Mm. You know? So she's brave enough to go 
I'm gonna go. And of course, I mean, well, who's she gonna leave all that money, you know, uh, to? Yeah, exactly. her family and stuff. But yeah. it's beautiful. Was it Have them kids. You're a billionaire. You're successful. Great career. Great run. Yeah, man. That's that's power right there. Remember, I always tell you guys that uh, I'm always right, and you should give me my flowers. What? It's it's a shame what the song of the year again. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I'm oh, the Like <laughs> <laughs> has got something. Hey, you're gonna miss me when I've got ghost. Hey, you are gonna be here forever. Man, so you're gonna be sorry, man. man. No, I'm just saying, man. No, but don't talk like that, man. Don't what talk like this, that, man? please. Who cares? Don't talk please. like that, man. Don't, on, don't. You always say that because then the invoices will bounce. <laughs> 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 like he's God. <laughs> it's not really important. However, ASAP has tried to propose to Rihanna, but she's the one that does not want to get married because oh. of the baby bumps. Oh. But it's not confirmed that she's on her third pregnancy, but she did say no to the marriage. But anyway, so remember this. Listen to this. Remember this, Ghost Lady. Mm-hmm. I think, yeah, you were part of this episode. Listen to this. Is it playing? Oh, wrong one. Okay, let me start again. We're still by the pool here. Okay. Yeah, man. That's how long ago this was. Speaking about artists, man, we shot with Blackie. How was that? Uh, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. yeah We're gonna yeah, drop yeah, it this yeah. week, man. We're gonna drop it this week, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're we'll dropping no, no. it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This yeah, week. Yeah, 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 yeah. What, what did you think about the interview before oh, I, I give you my thoughts? Fucking love Blackie. You know, Blackie. He's going places. He's smart. Is it? He's got a good hold on, head on his shoulders. Mm-hmm. He, yeah, no, no. He, he, he's humble and it's not fake humility. Not he's real. He's Easy going guy. Yeah. Smart, super talented. I think it's a recipe for success with the right team, of course. Nice. I think he's going for But I picked up something I didn't like. I felt some predatory vibes going on there. It's Blakey. Blakey. Mm. Predatory. Mm. No waste, bro. Mm. There was a lady, his manager. Yeah. Her name is Nicole. And if you check during the interview, he wasn't, I think we could have gotten more out of him if she wasn't there. Because if you check before you answered anything uncomfortable, you'd always look at her. Yes, true. I saw for, that. For a cosign to say, can I answer this? And, and we never do interviews with managers. Yeah. Uh, present, actually. So he's got a manager. She's a woman, right? And then he said during the interview that she, she practically is like the female version of Pete Diddy. She's got this house where these kids live and they make music and then she owns the music and she manages them. So for me, that's a red flag because whenever you see an old woman, I mean an old person, not even a woman, can be a man, yes. woman, whatever. Whenever old you see person. an old person with a young person, you must know there's some predatory... Oh, so the predatory vibes are from management. Yes, yes. So it turns out I was right, dog. What happened? Oh, no. what, what happened, man? What uh, happened? There's a tweet what I saw. There's a tweet I saw. Let me read it for you. Jeez. And I got in trouble after saying what I said about Blackie on that interview because he called me. He's like, what's this, bro? Even Pepper called me. He's like, what's this all about? I'm like, no, bro. I was just being honest. That's what I saw. That's you what know? you see, yeah. Yeah. And I sent him a couple of beats. Till this day, he hasn't responded. Blue <laughs> ticks all my uh, beats. <laughs> I didn't get a feature after of that. Of course. <laughs> Of course. But anyway, this is what it says. Né? It says, Blackie doesn't even own the car he said he bought, la- he bought last year. Nandi Mwepu is behind a company, M4 Entertainment, and manages A. Reese, Blackie, Anati, and previously Lucas Raps. Nandi is responsible as an artist manager for booking events, marketing deals, and publicity for artists. Since her breakthrough in the industry, the country has seen the international rise of rapper uh, Blackie. According to Zimoja, the businesswoman is also alleged responsibly for pocketing money meant for the award-winning artist Blackie. Those close to the business owner and uh, the rapper inform Zimoja or how heartful they are of the artist manager living a lie. A former business associate who does not wish to be named due to fear of intimidation being written off and comprising a brand says, it's all going to come out. I have nothing to benefit from exposing the truth, but Nandi is evil, she says. Blackie is under the impression that he owns the car that he's driving, but everything is under Nandi's name. The house where he lives in Midrand is under Nandi. The songs, the car, basically everything Blackie, she owns it. Blackie, Blackie as in Blackie. Blackie, Blackie. Currently. Blackie. Yes. The stuff so this Nandi has. is that woman. Is that woman. Did that you call her about. Nicole? Was it, did I say Nicole? Yeah. Yeah, but it starts with an N. So oh, okay. I yeah. guess the same person. Okay. Yeah. Mm. Child, that is, 
Black is huge, man. What Massive, bro. Black is we huge, should huge. listen to you more got, often. Then. I mean, I'm sitting here thinking he's got millions, and as he should, rightfully so, he's on the biggest songs. He gigs a lot. You know, he's got the following. He's 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 a superstar. Yeah. Yeah. That but, is foul. But is it not a thing of an agreement that they signed that maybe he was just not aware of? It's always like that. It's always yeah. an agreement people blindly sign. Yeah. Yeah, no tea, no He hasn't said a word. No, nah, he hasn't said any word. I don't think this picked up. I don't think anyone picked up on this. Did you hear about it? No, I'd never heard about yeah. I'd never heard about this, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nah, man. Hey, hey, hey. Justice for Blackie if he's being hot done like that. It I also mean, goes to say he is... Um, Dr. Pepper is her cousin. Uh, this 90 lady. Okay, cool. Uh, if you can scam your own cousin, then you're dangerous. The insider says she's related to somehow to Dr. Pepper, but she scammed her own cousin, Dr. Pepper. They were supposed to own the company together, but came the time to include him in the registration documents. His name was not there. Mm. And she's the sole owner of the company. Mm. Oh. So they, they were meant to start this company with Dr. Pepper. You know Dr. Pepper, right? Uh-uh. Uh, he used to the, be Ca- Casper's DJ. Casper's hmm? DJ. Mm. Then he started his own label. Oh, it's a guy. Yeah, it's a guy. I don't, I don't know him. Yeah. Phew. Shame, man. So when you're an artist and the car, there's a car being bought, what... What do you say? Isn't there a red flag like when you're gonna a car arrives? Oh, here's the car you've been talking about and wanting. Mm. You're just getting in and drive. Don't you yourself as an adult go to a dealership, choose a car, <laughs> sign the papers, pay, pay, yeah. pay if you're paying in cash, do the EFT or do the the financing yourself. You do, but Blackie's a kid, man. Nah, man, not anymore. Come on, mm? he's a youngster, Blackie? bro. He's a youngster, yeah, man. No, no, is- but. When you get into these things, guys, you can't at the end of the day. Sumiyama. Yeah. Like at, at the end of the day, like this is a valid question. You're right. When you are getting into a car and you don't sign anything as much as if now it gets taken away. Now we ask, which you never signed anything. To, you know, it, any, any debt can be taken. It's like a, a house the same, you know. It's the same. Like if you're staying there, you know, you don't pay rent. You don't know any papers. You've never visited them. You've red never flag. Signed. It's a red flag a right red there. Flag. Mm. Or maybe he did Because look they say, I mean Come on So feel your dream car There is that excitement yeah. I mean let's not lie You know Anyone get excited Drive it But when things Tone down and simmer down You ask who's with the hype Ang saina anga Ang patala anga I mean I'm a li So come on You know hey, But sometimes People who not finesse Can finesse Maybe but he, it's fine. You ah, look. You're making 900k or a million from bookings. Because you put me 10k every month is for the car mm, or whatever. Mm, you know mm, what I mean? Then you feel like oh, and then you're you feel like for, you're paying for you're it. Yeah, it. true. Your sweat, which it is your sweat. True. To be honest, but it's just not in your name. name. And some cars, That's you only sad. get the paper once you're done paying. All cars, right? Oh yeah, all cars, all yeah. cars. If all it's cars. finance, yeah, well, yeah, yeah. If it's finance, yeah, the yeah. ownership papers once you're yes. done paying. Yep. Man, that is. Even the house. Same. The house, bro. It's wild, man. Same. It's wild. So what that would mean is if the relationship ends between him and the manager, he'll still have whatever because surely he's got money. There's a bank account. He's got money that, you know, whatever he gets paid, it, you know. Mm. Um, that's all he's going to have. Mm. Everything else he's accumulated via assets and stuff. They're yes. going to then remain with the company. Yeah. Man, this, guys, this thing was happening to Abu Brown Dash and them with the Mini Coopers and stuff. Nabo, uh, who's the guy we interviewed? Nabo Briggs. Why is it still happening now? Yeah. Yeah. This is a team. It happened. Ah, oh, man. Like. Hey, did you see Chevy Sheets' numbers? Hey. Yeah. 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 They're twerking hard, those numbers, bro. <laughs> Fuck. There's that shit that they're twerking. I don't know. I've never like, seen I've something like that. Like, like, I've, I've never. never. I've never in my time, life, bro. It's your time, bro. Hi, like, yeah, 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 yeah. It's time, Half a bro. million in one day. That's nuts. Yeah, sass, bro. I was like, this guy, and I didn't know him, right? Yeah. Until the interview. And I didn't know how big he was, but my goodness, he's huge. He booked out the whole of December, fully booked already. Twacker. Yo. Shitter. And the beauty is that he's a nice guy as well, he's bro. A nice he's, guy. A he's a fucking nice, nice guy. guy. What you see on camera is what you see off yeah, air. No manga manga business. Ah. Ah, that guy's the realest, dog. Do you he's think he's gonna go far, bro. though? Eh? Like, how far do you think he's gonna go? Ah, he's gonna go ah, far, bro. Do you think he's one of gonna be just trending? Okay, but and then by next year, let's say mid year, we'll nah, be like, oh, nah, 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 bro. I haven't, I haven't seen people like someone like that maybe in since, a while since Aries when he he just uh, started in the game. 
Since Maybe. Peach Black Afro. Yeah, man. man. When he was like at peak. Oh, nah, this guy is massive, bro. Fucking hell. Yo. Like the goodwill he has and the love is incredible. Saint from the kids. I mean, you can tell. And also, we don't know how long his run for. Yeah. His run will be, you know, uh, will last because it's 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 God. I mean, he said he just did some songs, and someone put it on TikTok. He, next he thing. broke into studio. Like, <laughs> he broke into studio. You can tell even his stories. Like, there's, there's just a force behind the man. That's like, I, I mean, I hope his run is long, man. I hope yeah, it, I need hope so so more too. real, authentic artists like him, man. Yes, because they give hope, you know. But when, mm. And I think people relate to him and the rawness of it. They may not relate to the criminal activities in his past life, but they. They relate to someone real because it's a guy they can bump into in a taxi. They can bump into a, a, anywhere in the streets when they walk out. You know what I mean? And he owns a story and his story yeah. is of realness. So shout out to him, bro. Wow. what a No, he can really blessed. grow his brand. Like I wish he finds the right people around him, like a good team that can really like take him. Because I can see a lot. Remember how he even said he loves to, he would love to, he, like, he, like, he likes, he's a chef basically. He loves cooking. So we can do a whole lot of things, you know. And I said, it, like, it generally looks good. That guy can be... Remember in America, there was that uh, prison bay, the guy who came out of prison. The prisoner, and yeah, yeah. And got modeling deals. Yeah, modeling deals. Yeah. I think he's got that... I don't think he's cut from that cloth. Eh? I don't think, even think he needs management. He must just stay the way he is, man. You think? Like, how do you, how do you corporatize someone like that? You know what I mean? Like no, just to monetize. monetize. Maybe not changes. Yeah. You see, the right management would know mm, how to monetize without exactly. meddling too much with him mm. and his authenticity. Because so. he is the, the brand or whatever. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. It's super yeah. authentic, man. Yeah, you're right. He can grow. But he can grow. Nasim's going to be around, man. You know? You know? Like, and obviously he's educated. He, so he can do a smart. lot of other... He's very smart. He owns his cars, yeah. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> 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 I am just getting you, man. Hey. hey, what's on your mind, Pinduka? What do you want to talk about, dog? Oh, man, did you see uh, banks? Banks are foul, man. Did you see that banks have been messing up with the rent? And uh, I saw a tweet, right, which summed it up, which sums it up pretty perfectly what generally happens in the world. You know Kushik from Twitter? Uh, the guy who shot on Euphonic. Yeah, the finance guy, right? Yeah, so yeah, he used yeah. to be like, he's a proper finance guy, a credible guy. Yeah. He said, um, I am Kushik. You guys will put it in here, no? Mm -hmm. He said, the government gets rightly dragged for corruption, fiscal mismanagement, fraud, and financial crime. All the time. All the time. Yeah. But They're we probably need... getting dragged right now somewhere. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'll probably have a rant later on, you know, and drag them also. Mm. Okay. But we need to keep the same energy for the private sector. Run by Hallelujah. The run by the sharpest minds engaging in similar activities as the government and politician, but on a bigger scale, yep. using sophisticated financial tools. Mm -hmm. mm. There's a quote, and I've heard this before. Then he posted, he says, give a man a gun and he can rob a bank. Mm. Give a man a bank, he can rob the world. Buzz. Shout out, man. Buzz. Shout out. But it's not better than Chevy's freestyle. <laughs> huh? Talk shit. And then he, he recommended Talk. some movies to watch shit. Wall Street yes. from 1987 Watch that Boiler Room, I think you've seen yeah. that With yeah. Ben Affleck, yes. 2000 mm. American Psycho, 2000 Enron, 2005 Margin Call, 2011 Too Big to Fail, 2011 uh, Arbitrage, 2012 The Big Short, 2015 I've mm. seen that as well mm. um, Inside Job, 2010 Rogue Trader, 1999 And it happens day in, day out And they get a slap on the wrist Nothing Standard Chartered They are part of this bullshit And the article says They were making a trillion a day Yeah right? All, all these, these banks. banks All these separate banks mm. A trillion a day And then a, a Standard Chartered um, Was fined to pay 49 million No, they what? were not fined They said, yeah, we did Yeah, yeah They, 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 yeah, they admitted and they said admitted How much is the fine? fine? <laughs> What's 49 million, guys? When Oaks like, yeah, yeah, we did yeah, we did. Yeah, how it's much 42, is the fine? 42.5 yeah. million. 42.5 million. million. What yeah, is that fine. compared to... There's a huge injustice, man. What and, they've done. Yeah, and also what Kushib said was that there's obviously regulators who watch, you know, who are meant to police these guys. But the sharpest minds in finance and in industry are not working at these regulators. No. It's like... In the world, the sharpest minds are not the police. No. They're the criminals committing the crime, outsmarting the cops every day for lunch. Yeah. So it's a big, 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 like, 
injustice in the world, man. You know, we shit on governments and all these criminals. But these very corporate guys are making hundreds of millions, you know, through crime, essentially. And you wonder who... Benzana, I wonder Hyde Park were always having tea and lunch. They manufactured inflation in SA for years. They created it. All those food prices, Thank repo you. rates, fuel prices, housing, How does rental it prices, us? weaker rent, high interest rates. Look at that. They even fixed the bakery because that's where the dough is at. You know. <laughs> 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 yeah. ah, these fuckers, man. Bro, and what's sad is nothing's gonna happen to them. Nothing happens yeah. to these fuckers. Nothing. They get a they pay a fine. I mean, if I've made a billion rands or five hundred million, what's it and as an individual, what's a 30, 50 million rand fine? Fine, exactly. You know what I mean? It's 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 and those are the real gangsters of the world. Even there's a guy, fun sale, something fun sale. He exposes banks for charging black people more interest. Mm. Let me Google, let me find him. Hmm. You know what I mean? Peace, motherfucker. Eh? And who carries the brunt of all these crimes? Us. You know, just regularly, regular, regular people. Maybe sometimes not black people, but just the regular working Joe. EFF on Rand Manipulation revoke guilty banks' licenses, prosecute directors, and seize their assets. He's mm. right. He's right. And this has been going on for years, Shut bro. Down the fucking thing. But they can't. Those are, the, those are our presidents, chief. Those they are our leaders. Those are the people who run the country. Run, yeah, if you yeah. got the banks, you run the world, like that guy said, it's man. It's disheartening, man. It's super disheartening. They're probably laughing at us, man. These are some of the banks involved, yeah? Please correct me if I'm, if I'm wrong, ne? Fed yeah. check. Uh, Investec, Capitec, EBSA, Standard Bank, NetBank, First Rand, FNB, RMB. These are all the banks, right? This is mm -hmm. all of them. Yep. My fucking goodness. This is all of them. Yeah. Ah, yep. man, this is fucked As you see, it's, it's when you just do your groceries. And the middle class shop. is suffering, eh? Mm. eh? Middle class. Eh? At this middle rate, literally, the middle class, you, you are, the middle class are literally ro are, are at the, are on the verge of poverty. Mm. Let's be honest. We, we are literally going to have no middle class. It's either you're rich or you're poor. Yeah. Yes. So, Pia, what do we do, dog? Mbana, give us some sound advice. Since I'm busy. For real, what do we let's do? This is bad, Let's speak to the AI. And, and no one's covering it on, on mainstream media, ne? Yeah. No one's covering it, ne? Not yet. Everyone's no, no, quiet. No, 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 they are. No, they are. No, no, they are. Has a, it's on, it's on the, the media, but like, it's just going to pay fine. It's Because it is a breaking news, but we yeah. don't know how far it's going to go. That's the problem. Google, Google Emerald Fun Zale. Emerald Fun Zale. Like, literally, he's just dedicated his entire, you know, like years recently in, in, in exposing injustice done by banks, charging black people higher interest rates on your car. on And you wonder how sometimes someone qualifies to pay for a car for seven years or whatever and they pay a crazy amount yeah. and the same bank says no. You know what I mean? Try get a loan. Try get a loan oh. for a business. Yeah. Try, try get a business loan. You know what I mean? I tried to get it's a loan uh, two weeks ago. I said no. And you're you're all over. The the podcast is growing. It is successful. The well, I don't think they there. know the podcast. The guys that were issuing the loan. But I'm saying, as a black person, no. But your work is there. You, I mean, what more do you need to bring? A year's sta statement. I submitted everything. They said no. I couldn't get a loan, bro. What? On what basis? Uh, I don't know, bro. How much do you want? <laughs> also, that's maybe the problem. <laughs> How much? How much? Meter halfway. How many meters? Is halfway? How many meters? Does it is halfway? Twenty meters? No, the the cash flow for the business was bad, so I had to take a loan. Yeah, 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 yeah. Generally, you know, businesses run like that. Like Uber hasn't made a a profit. Only started making a profit this year. Uber, 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 Uber. Yeah, they've been running on overdraft loans and credit all along. Wow. Please check the fact check. I don't want to be spewing. No, no, shit. that's true. I've, I've seen that. Yeah, I've seen like that. literally, that's how these guys do. Utuaibo can cause these financial crimes. Marcus Yusta of um, Steinoff. Steinoff. Yeah, like those guys, they borrow, borrow money into that billions oh. with the hopes of and the projections that they, they will make money make you know that's back. why there's a move one of these movies i haven't seen but there's a term when they say a company is too big to fail when you're so big you own you owe like billions and billions worth of banks they'll make sure you don't fail you can't fail so if you need more money they'll we'll pump more money more into money. it and that's where now irregularities mm. start in the guys cookbooks and stuff like that but most of most companies you see and you use on a daily basis some of them don't make profit for a while 
and then they eventually make profit because they're playing the long game. Hectic. Was that bullshit. Robert Boy's manager calling? Oh, yeah, guess hello, Rick. Yeah, guess hello, man. There's nothing sinister happening on this podcast. <laughs> well, Dudu walked out. She just walked back in. That's yeah, what I was saying. That was, that was Dudu. Yeah, yeah same fact checker. Um, yes, so what you're saying is true. Um, they finally reported um, 326 million profit. And last year they made a loss of $713 million. And do you know who else hasn't made a profit? Spotify. Mm. Spotify owes the, the major, the majors millions and millions. Mm. Yeah, that's why now majors are dictating to Spotify. That's why the game is rigged. Oh, yes. So, and that and, and, you independent artists. And now TikTok's about to change the game, though. Now. Yes. Did you see that new feature on TikTok? Ah, what? what is it? There's a feature now when uh, if you use a song on your TikTok, mm -hmm. it will send you directly to the DSPs. So it will send you directly to iTunes mm -hmm. and you can buy the song. Oh, wow. So if I'm streaming Lonely Nights and I use it on my TikTok, I can buy it from TikTok. Shit. Do you get me? Yeah, 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 yeah. Wow, within yeah. TikTok. Yeah, within TikTok. Damn. Now we're gonna see the real numbers, cause TikTok is not. Uh, no. It's not. Um, it's not. You know, they they don't own it. Like, oh yeah. The labels. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's yeah, like yeah. authentic. Like yeah. if your song is big on TikTok, yeah. it's big. <laughs> like we'll yeah. know what's a big song. Yes, yeah, yeah. it's not manufactured. It's yeah. big. Yeah. yeah, it's not manufactured. Not just yeah. Yeah. like a song we all don't know. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. I get what you mean. Yeah, because Spotify pays. You know, like uh, well, they should be. They owe the the majors. So they eventually are owned by the majors because they owe the majors so much. Mm. Well, Tin. Yes. Just to add on to what Mike is saying, it is a new feature called TikTok Music. It was stated, it was released last month, and you get a one month free trial of it before you pay for the streams wow. for the song. So they automatically make a playlist from wow. whatever that you've been listening to for you. I want to know, guys, how do you manipulate the rent? Like, how do you do that? I have no idea, bro. Good question. Who can you call? I honestly also. Call Caesar, man. He Caesar would know. Man. Call Caesar. Caesar would know these kind of things. Yeah, man, it's wild, guys. The but criminals me, in this I, country I are not the to... guys you see on the streets, man. Yeah. The yeah. big criminals who, who make billions. The... <sighs> Trillion a day was being made by Imagine. banks all over the world, fucking with the rand. And then we are told, and then your petrol goes up, bread fucking goes up. Mm. We the ones who suffer. They driving around there in 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 Rolls Royces and Porsche Cayennes bought for the kids all over Hyde Park. But I equate and then it we to say great champions of industries. They work hard. Bullshit. Nope. Criminals. It's the like the lot. fixing of bread prices. I think that's maybe equivalent. There's yeah. a cut off for everything. There's a cut off for everything, yeah. guys. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's not answering. <laughs> oh, <excuse me. laughs> anyway, Ghost Lady. All right, on a lighter <laughs> note, what you got for us? Yeah, yeah, by yeah, the way, yeah, these stories are brought to you by my Pepa and Daba. You know, you know, you know. All righty. Okay, so um, Bonang was oh, um, cool. uh, spotted in Rome with old David Pume. He's a technologist. He's now he's not someone who is like we know, like very like popular. Is he related to Paul Pum? You remember Paul Pum, Mr. South Africa? You're mm. too young. South Africa, Paul Pumi. One my advert that we sell house. Hey, yeah, ne? I, no one does. And Mazu Paul Pumi. And Mazu Paul Pumi. Maybe uh, uh, fact check a Google. Ah, uh, 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 I need David Mashabe like this to me. <laughs> he can corroborate what I'm saying, man. Paul Pumi. Actually, we oh. haven't had. If you talk about Mr. South Africa, we haven't had Mr. South African in a while, right? Yeah, the last time they just trained for looking funny. Yeah, call Brad Dave there. Is he here, ne? Yeah, I called Brad Dave then. Yeah, you know who, know. Who, who, who should call? Who? Zimasa. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, uh, Mustafa. He would know how they manipulate the rap. I have his number? You definitely do. I do. Okay. okay. Just share on the group there. I'll call Okay, them. cool. No stress. Hey. Um, content. So, so Bonang's dating who? Um, so they, it's it's she's alleged. It's not confirmed yet. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So the story is that you know they were seen together in Rome with Paul Pume, and, and there's rumors circulating about them dating. So it's. But uh, wasn't she dating an American nigger? Uh, Remember when she spoke about an American guy on a reality show or something? It's in the content group. Thank Zimasa you. Vabaz. We Zimasa move. Vabaz. 
Oh you know, damn! Okay. You know, you know, Monang. If something doesn't work out, you know, the girl's not gonna yeah. stick around forever. Yeah. You know, and and just try and force a relationship. That's what. Did you ever think? I'm honest, man. I'm not interested in who Bonang is dating, man. Like, yeah. I like, am shame. I'm for really, real. I'm rooting. Not not really like rooting for her. You wish but, she finds love. Yes, proper, something proper, proper love. You know. I wish every human finds <laughs> proper love, though. But I get you if it's close to you. Yeah. But Dave, but Dave, you have to pull pull me. Yeah, yeah. Who's, who's Paul Pume? He even brought things to South Africa. That, Paul Pume. That, that that he he is he still alive? He was uh, Mr. Soweto. Mr. Mr. South, South Africa. Africa. Proud to call him Mr. Soweto. Obvious. Yeah. Uh, he was a cool guy. Gentleman. I don't know. Nice guy. Nigga, Which year was this? He I was, the, this he nigga, was the uh, Ma, uh, Maponyani son. What's his name? Of, of, oh, of, Max O. Oh. He was, he he was, was the of, maps of, of, of our of time. Yeah. He was the maps of <laughs> the 90s, man. No, no, wait, wait. <laughs> Brad Dave just said he was the maps of our time, meaning yeah. his time. I'm old, When man. now? <laughs> this was in so. the 90s, man. Hey, and I, uh, man. You can't make me feel bad for knowing stuff, you know no, what I mean? Okay, okay, yeah. okay. Yeah, this was in the 90s. I was a kid, but I knew Paul Pume. Did man. you ever yeah. wish to be Mr. South Africa? Because our mom would go like, oh, Paul Pume. Ah, Paul Pume, <laughs> okay. Let, let me ask you this one. Do you know... Uh, Masha Tena. Masha Tena. Uh oh. Don't worry. <laughs> Do you know Shemeshit? <laughs> <laughs> that's an important one. You know, that's a good that's an important one. Yeah. South Africa's greatest rap. Yeah. I know him. Cold, you, cold. You, you enjoyed the episode, eh? Oh, it was my favorite by far. Yeah. Wow. You had wow. many, but I, I loved it. I wow. couldn't, I watched the whole thing from beginning yeah. to end. Yeah. So are you gonna invite um Shibishi to you to your podcast? I'm not sure if he'll, he'll agree. <laughs> of course, oh, he's a chilled guy. Yeah, oh, actually, we got him a gig. He's, just, he's at Stones. Uh, he was at Stones on Friday. Yeah, yeah. Zook. Yeah, yeah Zook. Zook. Sorry, yeah, Zook. Yeah. He's a fun guy. He I is. absolutely love him. We try to get him uh, endorsed by tomorrow tonight as well. Yes, yes, yeah. yes, 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 yes. So I'm saying ah, that's, guy, man. Nah, that's our guy. That's our guy. Shabishit is our guy. I'm man. saying Masha Tena is the Shabishit. <laughs> <laughs> So who's Masha Tena? Masha Tena was a model during our time. Trust me, there's parents who are going to watch this episode and say, yo, David, you remember yeah. Masha Tena? I know. One of those ladies who used to do advertise larks during those days. And give a Paul Pume of, our, of that time. Also, also the late Kwan Nicola's wife. What's her name? How was that? <laughs> I, you, I know the name, man. She was also like a... A yeah. flame back then. So we, yes. we're basically reminiscing about old pretty people. Well, you're a smart <laughs> guy, man. What do you think about this rent manipulation thing? Look, it's a, it, it, uh, there's a lot of things that gets manipulated. Uh, that's just the life we live. Yeah. Uh, there's an episode that I was watching yesterday of how Shell was stealing, uh, what's that, um, uh, oil, oil. In, oh. in, in Nigeria. Mm. Uh. And they were funding... Uh, guys who were killing those who were protesting against them. Mm -hmm. So there's a lot of manipulation everywhere in the world. So yes, there is manipulation of, of the rent. <laughs> yes, Fat Checker. But nothing's going to happen to them. It's just like we must just live with it. Oh, Peggy Sue. Peggy Sue Kumar. Peggy Sue. No, yes. <laughs> yes, I remember Peggy, Peggy Sue Kumar. Yeah, she was married to God Nicole. I mean, so rest in peace, man. Peggy so yes, Sue the rent gets manipulated. That's, that's a fact. Uh, the problem with us as South Africans right now is that we... Ah, we are just sitting. We're doing nothing. Eh? Mm. Yeah, we are just watching watching our, our country get taken away well, by passengers. all sorts of people. Yeah, what can we do, though, but passengers. Okay. There's a lot we can do. Uh, if we look at the uh, Fed check, check out uh, what happened in 1985 in South Africa. Okay, South Africans were. were oh, Peggy Sue! Oh, she was up You remember yeah. Peggy Sue? Come <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Yes. Hey, hey. Look at 1985. The activities of what was happening in our country. I might need that Vaseline now. <laughs> No, Spiwe has it. <laughs> so they didn't get that. Ask, 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 but Dave, yes. Um, you're speaking about the first state of emergency that was declared on the 20th of July, 1985. There you go. What happened? So what, what happened? happened? Basically, we, we South Africans, and this is this was not only 1985. I'm highlighting 1985 specifically because it was a very violent year in South Africa for a lot of reasons, but it was... Black South Africans who were expressing their anger and they were blowing up 
uh, everything and anything. Pick up any date on, on that year. You'll find a limpet mine found uh, at some po post office. You'll find uh, uh, power turbines that were blown up by South African blacks who mm. were expressing their anger against apartheid. Mm. Basically, South Africans right now, we're not angry enough. We mm. don't do anything. We don't, bro. We just let it, let it be. Instead, it becomes conversation. And Twitter, that's as far as it that's goes. It. That's as far as it goes. A young hashtag. Yeah, yeah that's it. That Do you want to pick up any other day? Mm. You see, we were, we were just... We, South Africans were more active or, on a lot of things. We were protesting, go slows... Uh, what what do they call that day when when, when we shut down the country? Mm. That happened quite often. 1976 is a perfect example of that, but it never stopped. In 1985, uh, President Nelson Mandela was offered a release uh, by P.W. Bota and he refused. He said, you're, going to, you're releasing me so I can just go and sit at home. Mm. I want to continue fighting for, for liberation of our people. Mm. So it's that type of year. It's, when, it's the year when uh, P.W. Bota said, uh, you're, you've gone too far. He did the Rubicon uh, speech where he said, you guys yeah. have gone too far. Because South Africans were violently against the apartheid government. The question <clears throat> is, how different is it that period to now? It's That's worse. the question we ask. Worse now, bro. See, they do it in plain sight. However, we're not angry enough. No. But but then, that's I think that's because back then black people were more homogenous in a sense that a lot of them, if 90% were broke and poor. Now, how many times do you drive past a deep slot? You see people burning tires. Those mm. people have had enough. They're angry enough. But till, as long as there's other black people who are comfortable, those won't take to the streets. Till the day, the, those people who are advantaged and privileged feel like, okay, this is getting too much. We've had enough. Then everybody... So load shedding is not enough. Like It's not enough if wow. you're not taking to the streets. Wow. If it's you're so, like, I got a generator, bro. I'm that's good. it. Yeah. If you're like, at least I can still, we're not angry enough. And those who are angry enough, let's not be blind to them. There's a protest every day in South Africa. Yeah. People don't have water, electricity. They're not working. They're unemployed. They're always burning tires. Tina Sampang Moto, Till we are also inconvenienced, then we'll take to the streets. I said, Lulu and Jay, we're even complaining. We, no, no, oh, we yeah. those complain people. about them. You're right. Yes. Yeah. We even complain about them to say they've blocked, they're causing traffic. Mm -hmm. That's mm -hmm. what, you know what I mean. Like, look so how this yeah. robots are so dirty. Yeah, so, or, you know, or, yeah. so back then in the 80s, there were few, few and far between black people like that. Yeah. So it was easier for us to feel the brand at the So the, the same middle level class is too comfortable. Go. Yeah, there's a, mid, there's a black middle class now. Mm. That's the, and that's part of the problem as well. You know mm. what I mean? It's a good thing, but it's part of the problem. So those who are shouting there, their voices aren't heard. Uh, Pradev, how do you vote in the summers? You were part of the panel, eh? I was yeah. part of the, oh, of shit, the panel. How does that work, man? I was given a, a specific category. You yeah. get you get a category. And uh, you you I think it's based on your interest of that type of music. Yeah. Because I was given a category that kind of works with the kind of music I play on radio. Mm. So you get lots and lots of these songs. You don't even know what they are, who these people are. There's a lot of artists who enter who we don't know. So you have to listen to the songs if you don't know Listen them. to all the songs. Listen to all the albums. You have to okay. listen to the albums and, and vote. And what are you looking for? I don't for? even know if I'm allowed to tell you this. Ah, they won't, no, they won't I fire. think it's transparency. Yeah. And also, it's, it's, it's after the, the... Do you get paid? No, no, no. You do it for paid. the love of it. You do it for the love of it. So how do I uh, register to be like you? I got a call. I don't know how. Oh. <laughs> yeah, 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 so which um, <laughs> categories were you it was involved Afro, in? Afro pop. Oh, uh, Strava won that. That category. Oh, Strava. 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 Shout out to Strava. We don't know what's happening, but they're releasing winners bit no, by no, bit. I think it's two days. Okay. So there's uh, tomorrow is the one that's going to be on TV. Yes. Yeah, the, um, the one on Saturday. And then the one on Friday isn't on TV. But there's still some big um, categories uh, there. Uh, Murder Bombs won. Yeah, Best Dance. Shout out to Murder. Shout out to him. I can't wait to see his uh, thank you speech. So he came to Kaya, right? Mm. It was on... Uh, my top 10 at 10. Mm. And I asked him, I was like, bro, when are you coming to the podcast? We really would like to know what happened between uh, the two of you. Mm. Then he said, wait till we hear my acceptance speech at the summers. <laughs> so apparently he's going he's gonna, to he's gonna address that a bit. Yeah. I can't wait. I hope he does. He doesn't check it out. But that's what he told me. Wow. So we'll see. Yeah, we'll see. Hey, murder. <laughs> Why didn't hey, he just man. tell you then? <laughs> I'm trying to teach you. Wow. <laughs> 
<laughs> That's dramatic, bro. I was like, okay, we'll see, bro. I'll go away. I hope you win. Like, what I is he going to say? <laughs> you... I don't know. I don't... He's going to address it. I don't know. He's got words for the small. I don't know. All right. No, yeah. cool. no thanks, bro, Dave. Appreciate cool. it, man. Thanks cool. for the haircut yeah, as well, yeah. eh? Ah, thanks for the echo. Thank you, thank Yay. you. Hey, that's too long. <laughs> thank you, Brad Dave. Shout All right, Ghost Lady, anything sure. else? Oh, yeah. Better days. Um, another rumor of um an, a, a, another uh, relationship brewing. Yeah. So Sarah Langa mm. can't stop posting black coffee on her, on her Instagram. Oh, wow. She's probably hinting that they are an item. Oh, wow. So we don't know. But doesn't he have like uh, international honey? The one that he's always posting with. Could, I think he even mentioned, remember when he yeah. was with us on the, on the show, you mentioned he's got, a, he's got something. I, don't know. I just saw a picture of them in the snow sometime. I think it was on Instagram. I'm not sure. They're slow sometime. In the snow. Snow. Oh, snow. in the snow. We're taking a picture in the snow somewhere. Snow bunny? Mm, she's look mixed race. Mixed race. Yeah. Snow bunny is a, it's a, it's an okay term, right? Yeah. Yeah. But, wait, yeah. but we doesn't black coffee fine. maybe, isn't he the type to have his table? Hey, I'm just saying. I don't know. Well, I'm he's just Zulu. Saying, you know, not that about he wears. He, 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 he's an African. So we are Zulu and Australian. God, he pays. Oh yeah, Australian. It's just uh, uh, no. There's been posts that she's been putting up, like apparently on her Insta, with a black coffee. So I don't. She's is it is it is a possibility a possibility that she's hinting on a relationship? We don't know. Yeah, mm. what? So I'm just saying, Uguti, since you're saying that oh, oh, Black Coffee has got maybe like linked up with another person. So I'm just like asking, is he not the kind of guy that you think who would have his team? Since he even said he doesn't want to get married, you know, mm, maybe he's, mm. um, he doesn't want to just get, um, be in a relationship with just one person. Or maybe he just doesn't believe. And still ah, but these things are tricky. What if he's just a fan and likes the music and mm. she's just posting it? You, you I remember there was a time she was in Greece and he was also in Greece. You know, those Twitter c- detectives when they do their thing mm. and stuff. I, I've seen that before. Oh, because people was do like that. Years ago, like last year or something. People do that. Ago. When yeah. you, obviously, it's like when you're posting and you're traveling, they'll find out who are you with. Mm, mm. You can never travel alone. And he's paying 50K, I just saw now, now, um, oh, yeah. for child maintenance, for right? For child maintenance. Who? Cool. Mm, yeah. Mali, yeah. And, yeah. Yeah. and, and I think there was a, it's a post and someone questioned how much is, and she was just open enough to respond and say, no, she gets 50,000 rand for maintenance for the kids. Okay. Hey, but that interview helped him, eh? Because after that interview, all that interest shit went quiet. Hey, eh? nah. Yeah. <laughs> what you doing? <laughs> what tool? That's oh. good. <laughs> Not a tool. <laughs> but wasn't it also kind of after that tried to say, oh, I'm also going to talk, but nothing happened. At the end of the Oprah. We are the Can I just say something? Yes. The story Kanye reported on from my paper and last week. Yeah. About Anele Zondo. Yes, yes. It ended a relationship of someone that works in this podcast. <laughs> Are you aware? Kanye. Wait, who? Oh, 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 oh. Obviously, I won't say her name right now, but you lit- it literally ended that relationship. On the network of this podcast. On the network. Ah, yes. oh. Oh. Ah, dude, who? You have to be open. Who? You have to be open. Yanda. You were not hard. Yanda. Yanda. You have to open up yeah. now, dude, to Australia. Why? Yeah. Why? 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 Whatever. No, because the story is, I, I, I won't, it has a title. Now I have to say that, okay. Anyway, the story is. Yeah, you can't just mention that and not tell us. What's wrong with you? Yeah, why do you mention it? I can. Cause you I'm, can't. <laughs> what do you mean you can? You can't. Yeah, it <laughs> but um, well, it? she, the story she reported on. So I saw, I, I, what I'm trying to say is that maybe there's some truth to, to some of these stories oh. from Pepanda, but oh, that's yes, where I'm trying to go. Yes, yes. Oh, because, there's some yes, because what she reported last week, it ended a relationship before Whoa. what she, rela- she wow. reported. So Ooh, Yanda Woods. there's some credibility. Yeah. It has to be Yanda Woods. We don't have a lot of females here, guys. There's yeah. plenty. Yeah. Yeah. Processes of elimination. Seema's yeah. with Ghost Ruby. Seema's with them. Ghost Ruby. Uh, Tato is with Fed Checker. Uh, yes. yes. Yes, take yeah. it, take it. Yeah, my daughter, and then Zan, my daughter. Take it, take it. Mama Shao, Mac. Dudu is uh, freelancing. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> 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 more fire lap. <laughs> <laughs> Who else is there? Who else is there? Uh, 
Tepi from onside. Yeah. Tepi from onside. Who's you with? Mm. We don't know. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Hey, Kulum, Kulum. Uh, no, I don't know. But oh, what I know is, wait. Hey, Kulum, Mama, Kulum. No, what I know is, these Kuruma. guys say, um, me- Okay, it so is. why why is Let's this person breaking up? Because they were part of, they were dating one of the guys. Or- yeah. Whoa. So they, you know oh, what she, what she specifically said to me today hey. that, um. So after what Ghost Lady <laughs> reported, oh, oh, she started by saying, "Dude, where's me find out?" <laughs> and I was like, oh, "What?" Damn, She's like, "I found out through what Ghost Lady reports." Oh shit! Yeah. That's why. That's sad, guys. I didn't mean to break up a relationship. <laughs> you, yeah. you, 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 you possibly you could have straight, helped. Man. I don't know, but it yeah. did end that relationship. So I'm just coming on the point that there could be some credibility. Yeah, no, I get what you're saying. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, that we get. Yeah. Wow. That's good. <laughs> Wow. Whose relationship I think is I'm next? Helping people, you know, make their decisions faster. You know, <laughs> I'm here to clean up the Cholo streets. I'm here. <laughs> hey, Peduka, <laughs> any last thing that you want to talk about nah. before I go to the announcements, man? What else will happen? I'm good. Yeah, man. Yeah. Well, it was uh, just a financial thing that pissed me off, really. Snoop Dogg quitting. Smokes, weed, ne? Did it? You finished? He, that post is yeah. weird. That is, it's like he says he quit smoke. Yeah. I quit smoke. What smoke? Bro, he said he quit smoke. What smoke? Maybe it's a take. But do you really care if he stops smoking or not? I, I don't, personally. But there are people who okay. say, I still smoke because of oh, Snoop, Dogg. Snoop Dogg. Yeah, that's stupid. And they... Mm. Yeah, no, 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 no. You know how people, you know, want to reason. Jesus. And... So for the fact that someone, maybe their idol says, I'm quitting, and maybe they need to quit. It could be a good sign. It's like, ah, you know what, ne? maybe it's a sign for me to also quit. So it could help another, like, probably hundreds and thousands of people, you know, who could just make it a good decision just for their health. That's reaching, Goslid. Really? Ah, that's people reaching. smoke because it's dark smokes. <laughs> no. Man. I'm sure there are people my oh Bemel yeah. and Lendo I know Snoop Dogg we are pay. Why man I want to talk about Kulum Snoop Dogg we are come on the money to blow me ah Snoop Dogg we are pay but one. Hey bro, who's this? Who's this Kamaga guy? It's Kamaga. Oh Skomota. Sko, who's that guy? Bro? I don't know why it's around the Skomora. Oh, we're gonna have him as a friend Oh, let's bring him on the friend of the show. Oh, shit. Okay, bring him on, man. Put this dance move. I don't see Peter. 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 No, he's from... I don't see Peter. No, he's not from Peter. He's from that side, from Haskukun or something like that. Oh, Haskukun. He's Pedi. Yeah. He's Pedi. Oh, who's Komota? What does Komota even mean? I, I don't know, Doc. Don't hey, Maro, what a Limpopo. We've got entertainment by the balls, eh? Hey, you've got it, boy. Hey, you've got it, boy. Hey, hey, I was coming hey. on that. I was shaking shit. shit. Hey, hey, hey. Hi, hey. See you later. Hey. See you later. Hey. Hey. See you later. See you later. See you later. See you later. I know, Shem. I know. Oh, okay, I want to chat to that guy, man. Yo, Limpopo man. boys <laughs> won't lie. <laughs> Let's make it happen. Uh, songs I put my name on. Mm. It's I finally know. coming out. Going, it's coming out, bro. Nice. We got the first single. We're dropping the first single this Thursday. Hey. Oh, sorry, this Friday. What's it called? Uh, it's Ooh. called. It's called. Hish. Mm. Hey, there's too many. Uh, fuck, man. What is it called? Fuck. Fuck a frostan. 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 Yes. Fuck a frostan. Oh, I'm cold for So it's fuck a frostan. Fuggy the producer is Fizo El Musica. Okay, shout Featuring out. T-Man Express and Lim- Limit Crazy. How do, you, how, do you, how do you say it? Lim Crazy. Lemek Crazy. Lemek Lim Crazy. Lemek Crazy, ne? Yeah. Hmm. So shout that's out. dropping this Friday. Shout and out. then the EP is dropping 1st of December. EP 1st of December. Yeah. Shout out. What sound are we, are, we, are, we, are we going for? Ah, the streets talk. Good December, boys. Top, top. Ah, top, top. All the way. <laughs> ah, all the way, boys. <laughs> uh, there's <laughs> six <laughs> tracks. So, here's what happened. Eh? I chose... Um, shout out to Mac Lopez and Tuso. Oh, they were oh, like Mac my... Lopez is still in the camp. Shout yeah, out. Yeah, they were like my A&R. Is that what you call it? 
Yeah, yeah, A&R, yeah. Oh, so they helped oh. you select the songs. Yeah, yeah so we got over uh, like 200 songs. Okay. So they listened and then they sent me like 50 of the best ones. Wow. And then I chose from there. Mm -hmm. So I chose six, right? Damn. And three Must of them uh, feature this guy, fucking hot producer, man. His name is Sir J. Loot. There's three songs, ne? Mm. Uh, that by Sir J. Loot. Good and there's out. one, it's called Isinto Zam Zalom Saba. It features a girl who's in grade 10, oh, bro. It's She's on the vocals. Song. It's uh, Ghost Lady's favorite yeah, song. That's wow. My favorite song. So that's in the EP, right? Okay. So now, EP is done. I've sent it to Electro Mode. We're dropping uh, this uh, Friday. Yeah. And then the EP the other Friday, right? Mm -hmm. Then we get to the year end function. And this song that sounds like Ndu mm -mm. it's got that vibe, right? Mm. And I played that once and everybody just wanted to hear it. So everybody asked me that I must put that in as well. Oh, dope. Mm. So it's going to be seven tracks because oh. of the crew. The crew okay. song. Yeah, oh, they loved dope. it. Eh? Mm. Remember the song, you know? Everybody loved it. What's so. that called? I don't know. We don't have a name yet. What should we call it? Guys? Yeah, they must call it. Put, yeah, give us a name. Crew song. Crew song, eh? Yeah. Eh? Oh yeah, Titi liked it the most, so we're gonna call it Titi Way. Titi Way, Titi Way sounds like a dub dub song. Yeah. But it was a collective thing. It's yeah. called Crew Way. It's a Crew. Crew Way. Ah. Le Crew. Le Crew. Le ah ah. Nah. Nice. My my boy, you look crusade to my day like. Le Crusade. <laughs> Le Crusade. Le Crusade. Le Crusade. Le Crusade. The Crew. The Crew The Crew Way. Yeah, the Crew Way. The you know, sounds way. beyond okay. the Crew Way. Okay. Okay. Crew Way. And you're speaking of that 10 year old girl. Shout out grade to 10, grade 10. Grade 10. Yeah. Shout out to Chris Brown, man. Chris, oh, there's yeah. a girl, that girl. What's her name? Fact checker, help us out of the. Nale. 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 Beautiful, beautiful yeah. young girl. Shout out. Shout out to Chris Brown and his team, man, for featuring her on the song. A girl who went viral singing. Yeah. Who's that? Who's Hey, dude. Got many talents, eh? Hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. You <laughs> discover it. Look, pura mo po minute. What's it? Ha! What's it? Mount the, mount the. You look mount the. Um, buso wa operation tutula. Strong, eh? Shout out, man. Shout out to Chris Brown. Now we do do Teddy. Pula la. Oh, oh, la le, ni bueno. Oh. Oh, oh, la le. Oh, sorry, sorry, dude. Um, the song is called Shooter by Chris Brown, but where he took the sample from, um, it does not state exactly what the name of the song is. Yeah. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, it's a chance. It's a chance. Oh, wow. Because yeah. when she posted it and trended on TikTok, she was in school. It's, like, yeah, wow. it's in And class. she was just singing this song, you know. Wow. And then Chris Brown posted it on his stories. Wow. Mm. And then a few months later, sampled. when he dropped the album, he sampled, sampled it. it. Wow. But as much as the song is not feeding into what the song is about, Chris Brown's song, Chris Brown's song is a love song, but that other song is about, you know, Uba yeah. Bulala It's actually so very it's, it's sexual Nami in, a, in a bad yeah. way. Yeah, yeah, yeah because yeah. when he yeah. goes on, he even that's says, all. you know, now I feel like I'm the wife in this oh, home. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. 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 But her voice is beautiful mm. and she's credited there as a writer. Oh, yeah, everything. I saw that. Hey, she and she got 50,000, right? US dollars. Yeah. Wow. US dollars. Oh, wow. That's a mill. Shut up. Oh. That's beautiful, man. And she's in the, 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 the split sheets or whatever. Huh? $3,000, 15000 Oh, that's robbery. Eh? $3,000. <laughs> What's the source there? Oh, that's 50,000 rent, ne? Yeah. Yeah, it's okay. rent. Africa. That's the song. I hope, I hope she's still gonna get like royalties, you yeah, know? Yeah, she's still the. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The name she was has, oh, okay. yeah. She got credit. That's fine. Yeah. Then. Nah, that's fine then. That's cool. As a one star, ah, that's fine then. It's cool, man. Oh, yeah. And then I'm off to Miami this weekend, man. Oh, yeah. Tickets are almost sold out, eh? Yep. Apparently, I need to last week I said the tickets are selling. Mm. So the American children like, I lost track. Like, I They went to go buy. Yeah, the tickets oh, are so almost sold out. Yeah, they're sold out. Hey, yeah, <laughs> ne? <laughs> Ghost lady, what do you want to say? Ah, oh, guys, are we closing? Yeah. All righty. I'm good. Penduka, shanga pom lo. Yeah. Us shanga pom. Why? Man, for no close and close and man, for no school me, school man. Have you ever seen me angry, Madakais? No one came to your room. 
That's why you're sleeping. Ah, pelum na ka ba msaba lo? Yeah, no, no. Ah, ba siya ba msaba? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Naka sa matot. The way they scan ngati inkabi, ne? Yeah, you swear my husband inkabi. The way I. Ano ba sok to ya sok chile lo man? Babum na ka. Penduka. Babum na ka. Wow. Ah, we are there, man. Please welcome. Um, who we chanting from tomorrow tonight? Oh, flip, man. Heinrich, Heinrich. Yeah, Please through, welcome, bro. Heinrich. <laughs> wait, wait, what happened last time you were here? That was when the guy was... When they were investigating you, you the guys, gun stuff. Yeah, oh, man. yeah. The yeah, yeah, police yeah. came. You guys were busy. Yeah. And then the policeman was Vendor. It was from Toyanda. Yeah. And then we had a, a long chat. So. <laughs> <laughs> so when you left, you were like, these fuckers. <laughs> well, the thing is content. Eh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I mean, how many times was that watched? Like, 700,000 something. Jeez, yeah, I forgot. I forgot the numbers on that one. But it was wild, man. Lots. Yeah. We were a bit scared that day. I was scared, eh? I'm sure. I won't lie. When the cops were here? Yeah, oh, they're interrogating was. us. It was not our fault. Too. Yeah? They were investigating the other guy, not us. Yeah. Yeah. But the way they were moving, it sounded nah. like we could get in trouble. Nah, if we lied or anything, yeah, but nah. But you can't lie much because it was on screen. Yeah. <laughs> also, yeah. <laughs> anyway. But I wasn't too nervous about it. Cool, we ready? All right, cool. Ah, kind of down, Neil. Oh, Neil. Two point door. Ladies and gentlemen, please make some noise for the only white chiller we recognize. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, he, he's the CEO, the owner of uh, Tomorrow Tonight. Yeah, man. Uh, we've had him here before. Oh, he's come back. I got to say, man, bro, you saved me this life, man. I mean, this this year. Like, bro, I've been drinking like fucking hell. This year was crazy, eh? Yeah, my woman also swears by this stuff, eh? Mm. I remember mean, you saying. Yeah, you remember I told you last yeah, time. Yeah. You said I didn't lie. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, and she swears by it. She I literally it. have, um, uh, when we have gigs on weekend, I've got a DJ pack. Should we call it a DJ pack? What yeah. can we call it? Yeah, yeah. Where it's tomorrow tonight. Your bag, yeah. Yeah. Then I got some sign you tap for if I get sinuses along the way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And condoms. <laughs> I'm <laughs> kidding. Let's go. Let's go. I'm joking. No, I'm joking. I'm, I'm joking, man. It's not my. It's not my bag. I don't mind. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm kidding, man. I don't even know what he keeps in there. Yeah. I've never seen your shit. But, <laughs> but do you know? Uh, do you know Chevy shit? No. Oh, yeah. You got to get Chevy shit to endorse this, bro. No, who's that? He's like the biggest artist in SA right now. Yeah. Really? Yeah, and he yeah. drinks like a fish. He was drinking Grandeur Sonor. Yeah, without dash. dashing it. What? Like, so he needs tomorrow tonight. Yeah. yeah. Okay, definitely. Yeah? Shut yeah, up. Watch we'll last get, we'll get a hold of him. Yeah, watch last week's episode. You'll yeah. see right. him. All right. Only a million people watched it already, but you know, it's fine. You can oh, it's it. only a million? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay, now, well, then we'll look at it, definitely. <laughs> He's the last white chiller to watch it. Even white chillers have watched that. Yeah. <laughs> So it's not a true white chiller. No, nah, it's not. A true. <laughs> but I wonder, you guys was actually like said, let people send photos. All the white people, let them send photos to say nah. the subscribers. Yes, all the white people, and we'll see how many they are. No, we must have a brunch for white chillers only. <laughs> <laughs> white only. White only. Yeah. No yeah. This one. Yeah. <laughs> white only. Hey, white only. The white only. Hello. Look, I won't lie, but it's probably going to be a little bit boring. Right? <laughs> <laughs> nah, you guys get shit face. Nice. Never could never be boring. If you have brandy there that early, will be fine. Ne- we'll be lucky, yeah. Uh, since the last time you came here to speak about tomorrow tonight, has it gone? Uh, the sales? What yeah. has happened, man? Yeah. So um, it's really just gone from strength to strength. Ooh. I don't know how many times I have to say, uh, you know, thanks to you guys, but that uh, really helped us a lot. Um, yeah, uh, the fact that we've been copied uh, by a few brands says that something works. Um, and luckily, people have stayed loyal to the brand that was developed by pharmacists. Mm. And what's also nice is that we now see uh, medical doctors starting to prescribe the product. Wow. Uh, wow. And buying it in. So that's quite a nice endorsement, I think, for something like this, where they yeah. actually see the health benefits of it and not only the sort of social uh, scheme around it, you know, there's there's actual health benefits and and yeah. So brand's been doing really well. Um, you guys will see, you know, all over the stores at the moment. We've got massive promos and in-store promotions and things, and we've since expanded to uh, Eswatini. Oh, um, wow. you guys nice. have got a, quite a big following there. I don't know if you know. You know yeah, many yeah, people we're contacted away. us uh, after that, so it's now wow. in, in the Clixes in Eswatini. Um, wow. It's in the Discims in Namibia. 
Oh. Um, and in Botswana, the people from Botswana literally come over the border, buy it Whoa. in South Africa, and then they go back to wow. Botswana to enjoy it. Even in Botswana, so, we've got a footprint there as well. Yeah, yeah. so yeah. really after the previous appearance, I mean, the amount of people that contacted us from outside of the country, uh, from our neighboring country, wow. uh, countries, even as far as Kenya and Zambia. So that was Whoa. really, really nice. Yeah. No, man, shout out to the channel. Oh, shout out, man. Oh, man. That is so tomorrow, cool. tonight, everywhere. Uh, we know about tomorrow, tonight. So I'm watching now. I don't know. I didn't watch the first episode. What What is tomorrow, tonight? Yeah. Yeah, so just for a reminder for your additional, I don't know how many hundreds of thousand follow, uh, subscribers <laughs> that you now have. Million. Yeah, so, so well, more than, because last than time I was here, it was just under a million. Is yeah. it? Yeah, yeah. yeah, so it's grown by, I think, 200, 250,000 yeah. since then. I think more, yeah. Yeah, but it's a lot. It's like 1.2 million. Or yeah. yeah, please tell them to subscribe. Yeah, when guys. When right person says it, uh, it has more weight. <laughs> <laughs> well, now I don't want to say it anymore. So. <laughs> But yeah, yeah, guys. So, so really exp expanded great. And then um, the product, just for those who don't know it, the product was developed to prevent hangovers. Um, so a lot of, you know, other things people believe in will cure your hangover the next day. I personally don't believe anything cures your hangover the next day. Not even tomorrow, tonight. Um, it's a prevention product. So you must take it before you drink, before you go to bed. If you don't take those, it won't work. If you do take it like it, works like a bomb. Um, and yeah, it was developed uh, to sort of cleanse the liver because liver uh, toxification is, is one of the main reasons for, for a hangover. Um, it rehydrates you, so it's got electrolytes in it, um, so you don't have that dry mouth in the morning. Um, and it's got some B vitamins in it for you know, to keep your mind sharp. You know when you wake up in the morning, you've got that head, not the headache, because that you can sort out with tablets. Yeah. But you've got that like fuzzy brain oh, where yeah. you now need mm -hmm. to focus, but you can't. And it carries on like that for the whole day. Yeah. So that's basically the product in a nutshell. Um, it was developed by a whole group of pharmacists. So it's not something that was made by, you know, someone in his chummy yeah. in, his, in his garage. Um, and they just slap a logo. <laughs> yeah, slap a logo. And they normally make like serious, serious claims on it. They go, this will, you know, miracle. And all, it's only something like miracle the word miracles normally in there. Um, I know you're a pharmacist. What did you think about the whole Dr. Matthew thing? Yeah, that was quite interesting, eh? Because, you know, first of all, how did he then not end up, you know, being in trouble? Because um, he didn't treat anyone and didn't never prescribed anything to anyone. Yeah. So, so he just pretended to be a doctor. Well, that's the thing. But I mean, if if I can pretend to be a lawyer, for example, and I, I'm, I have, that's my business, giving advice to people and they take my advice as fact um, and that's dangerous eh? yeah. it's still dangerous so you know for me uh, and and look I think he's one of many mm. many many yeah. many in South Africa um, you know there's there's so much uh, our medical authorities under so much pressure um, in South Africa with all of the illicit stuff that's going around you know the last thing you actually need is a doctor that's you know, not a doctor. Mm. Yeah. Um, and they can't check up with every single doctor that's saying he's a doctor because how long? Like, are you going to be a doctor for two weeks? Mm. You know, because you'll probably get away with it. Mm. And that's what's scary. Mm. But Quick one, you said it's got health benefits. So does that mean even if I'm not going to drink, can I consume it? Yeah. Yeah. Even if I won't be drinking, right? Yeah. So, so the health benefits in it is is the um, the B vitamin. So that's to keep your mind sharp. Um, it's got some vitamin C in it. Uh, it's got the electrolytes. The thing is, you know, we drink way too little water. I don't know if you guys mm. want to shoot with how much water you drink. Yeah, I drink yeah, tons yeah. of water. Yeah, he drinks okay. a lot of water. I drink a lot of water. Yeah. No, not a lot, bro. You see, so, so uh, you know, let's say half of the people, my wife doesn't drink a single glass of water. Jeez. Jeez she's bro. much skinnier than I am, much prettier than I am, but she doesn't drink water. Yeah. So that's my only, like, comeback when she says, yeah. you know, you being being unhealthy with the brandy and coke and things like yeah. that. yeah. Um, but yeah, so, you know, you can take it every day. And that's something that I want to touch on just now when we talk about how much South Africans consume is that, you know, uh, it, people think, okay, I'm having a rough Saturday night I need to take tomorrow tonight. Yes, that's the truth. But if you like, you know, I have every single night of my life, I have two glasses of red wine. Okay. Um, uh, with my wife, we cook, we uh, when we eat, we also have another glass. And the thing is, if you don't give your liver and your kidneys enough time to recover, um, 
your, the damage to your, your liver and your kidneys is massive. So if you had a binge and you're getting on the train again the next day, which you know a lot of people do, and um, that's so 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 bad for your for your liver oh, and kidneys. Oh, I see what you're saying. Yeah. So, so I'm not if saying, you go hard on Friday, and you go hard on Saturday as well, mm. then you're fucking up your liver. Badly, mm. badly, badly. So your liver luckily luckily regenerates um, to an extent. But it needs time to regenerate. So a couple of days or hours or minutes. No, no, days. Days, no, no, days, no? days yeah. Before I you... see people drink like that, man. Yeah. How much do South Africans drink? Do you know the numbers? Yeah, so I, I worked it out this morning. If we're only talking beer, so South Africans consume about 36,000 uh, yeah, 36, milliliters. So it's 36 liters of pure alcohol. Hmm. Pure alcohol. And 30 is just between me and Matt. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> You know Jeez, what I mean? that's a lot, man. The thing but is, when uh, in a day, in a, in a, in a year. So, well, you can so, uh, well, we can do the calculation, but it works out to if you're talking just beers, right? Talking beers, it's about twenty-two thousand beers per person per year. Yo, no waste, bro. No waste. Like like this beer. No waste. Yay, yay, yay. No waste, bro. Twenty-two thousand. Mm. So wow. obviously we don't. So you got different people. Yeah, you yeah, got, yeah, yeah, yeah. You got the whiskey drinkers. I think I worked it out. It's about three hundred bottles of whiskey a year. Damn. Per person. Per person. One what? person. Fuck yeah. Nah, but but there's three hundred and sixty-five days in a in a, in a in and a year, man. That's weekends. average. That's one so point something a day, a bottle a day. So that's a scary thing. per person. So a beer like, well, normal beers have about five percent alcohol. Um, which means that a 330 has about 1 point or, or 16 moles of pure alcohol around there. So if you work that out, some people drink less yeah. and some people drink a ton. Yeah. And that's how they work it out, obviously. Mm. So, you know, an alcoholic, for example, would probably drink, I don't know, two bottles of hard tech a day. Easily. Okay, I'm not that no, no, I mean, bad. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no, so that's, that's like, if you're talking alcohol, that's almost a liter of pure alcohol a day. Oh, man. So that's how the, how the figure gets worked out. But the thing is, we drink a lot. And we were talking about this for teenagers now. The only African country that beats us in drinking is Eswatini and then Namibia. Huh. They drink more than us. Yeah, they make Vinduk there, so. In Namibia. Yeah, but yeah, in Swaziland, yeah. there's Sibebe. Uh, Spep. Spep, yeah. eh? Well, I'm still wine. Smebe. <laughs> you guys know Smebe? No, no, no. Very nice. But wow. um, anyway, so so uh, we drink too much. Uh, mm. And that's the point. And hey, we've got a lot of trauma, man. A hey. lot of trauma. Oh, they booze a lot. And very social. Um, and then you, you know, apart from the social people, you've got the real people who've got alcohol problems. Yeah. Alcohol dependent. Yeah. Mm. yeah. And they smash probably... You know, I was saying now it works out to about a liter a day. Fuck. So then you then you're looking at 365 liters of alcohol. A year. So pure alcohol. Mm. So that's how they get to the average. It's scary. Yeah. And um, and long and the short is that's why we developed this product because people don't think about their livers when they're having a good time or their kidneys. Yeah. yeah and these yeah. things are there to detox your body. Mm. So if you're not mm. giving it time. Um, it's going to get damaged at some stage. We just really, really drink a lot. And I'm not saying take one of these every single day of your life just for the fun of it. I'm saying if you're going towards the weekend, start drinking it on like Thursday oh. um, already. And that's, you know, the, the normal dosage of taking it before and when you drink, that's going to work. But if, when it comes to the, the long-term damage, you can't just take it every now and then but still drink in between. How much do I know to take? Like, I mean, if I'm a heavy drinker, should I take two sachets yeah. of this thing or will one do the trick no matter how much I'm going to drink tonight? Well, the point is, if you are an alcoholic tomorrow tonight, it's probably not going to help you. Because mm. um, if you drink that much, there's nothing that's going to help you. Probably not even in the hospital. Mm. Um, but the standard dosage is one sachet before with some water, about this much, mm -hmm. and one sachet uh, before you go to bed. So the thing is your body, anyone's body, regardless of your size, can only absorb as much of the active ingredients. Yeah, before you go to sleep works, man. Yeah. Work so up. before you're going to drink yeah. and before bed. Yeah, before bed works, man. Works like a charm. Okay, yeah. so there's no such thing as an overdose though of it. Could you possibly overdose? You would have what to, are the results of that? You would have to drink a lot. Okay, no um, one will in the right You would mind. have to drink quite a bit to OD on. Ah, so. okay, cool. Like you would, you would have to seriously go at it too. <laughs> 
Hein, <laughs> thank you so much for coming through, man. It's the nice. same as the Asia, as the Asia, as the Asia, as the Asia. Hello. Could I say in Dorigo and Amanda? Hey, Rodi Wonder, 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 Dando. Cheers. Dando. <laughs> Dando, Dando. Give it up for the one and only. Hi. 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 Welcome to Black Excellence. Do not fear, for if you do, just sip on some grandeur. And if you still do, ask ourselves, what would Mapapunzi do? Parama chilla, itlesha lefiki. Bungo even if when they ask you, how sabi in, do not fear. For if you do, just say, Anistivi. This is the medicine of censorship. This is the pill. Which one is that one? Podcast and chill.